What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Heart Gold Soul Silver walkthrough. Okay, so Yeah, we're gonna be capturing Lugia. Yay! Yay! Holy crud, oh my god. Okay, so yes, we are playing Pokemon Heart Gold. You guys can tell it is not gonna be an easy one. In Pokemon Heart Gold, Lugia will be at level 70. The other thing too is that you're gonna need the Silver Wing in order to get to Lugia. How you can get the Lu uh, the Silver Wing? Just go to Pewter City and talk to the old man, and you know he'll give you he'll hook you up with the Silver Wing and all that stuff. Now, if you're playing Pokemon Heart Gold, it is the opposite way around. Lugia will be at level 45, and it will be the Pokemon that you know you'll the the component the Komodo girls will be doing the ritual for. And, you know, everything's vice versa. You'll get the rainbow wing from the old man and get yourself a level 70 ho-oh. So, good luck. Seriously, good luck. Anywho, yeah, we're gonna be going straight to the, uh, we're gonna be going straight to the World Islands. And you guys can tell the, you guys can tell by the, uh, the, whatchamacallit, uh, the, not the frustration, but the, the excitement in my voice that, yes, this is going to be a fun one right here. Because it's not. It's not going to be a fun one. It's going to be horrible. We're going to be taking on a super-powered Pokemon, and we only got one Master Ball. And I'm kind of, I'm, I'm, like, I'm here thinking to myself, okay, so we are going to need, we are going to, like, need this Master Ball for something. And I, I realized that, well, there is another Pokemon that could probably be better off with the Master Ball. I decided that, you know what, let's, let's man up. Come on, we gotta man up and just capture this Pokemon the way, you know, the good Lord Arceus intended to, and that is, you know, with, uh, you know, our grit, our Pokemon prowess. And yes, we haven't took, we, we didn't even take this guy on. What the hell? Anywho, uh, you guys can see, as you guys can see, yes, I am playing the low quality, uh, I am playing the low quality, uh, this Mume app because, well, yes, we're gonna be going into a cave. And we're not gonna be seeing we're not gonna be able to see anything, so yes. We're just gonna be battling and as you guys can tell, I have brought I have brought in some of the big guns right here. The big guns. And uh, that is a tank. As many of you guys already know he's very tanky and uh, well it can learn world uh, whirlpool, so yeah, we, I think we're gonna be doing alright. We're gonna be fine. As long as we don't die or anything. So let's go right ahead and see where we can actually find this Pokemon. Now, I could be wrong. I, oh, you know what? This is, yeah, this is definitely the spot right here. There are four world islands. Each one of them are unique, and you do need specific moves in order to get to this place. Uh, you obviously, Surf, Whirlpool, and, uh, well, Flash, as always. And uh, the good thing is that we got the, all, those, uh, all those moves right there. So let's go right ahead and light up this whole thing and see where we can actually find this god dang Lugia. Yes, I am not. I am not excited about this, guys. We're literally going into the dragon's den. Honestly, I kind of feel like Lugia should have been a dragon. Whose idea was it to be a psychic and uh, water type Pokemon, or psychic and flying? I don't even know. Who, 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 whose idea was that? Because it looks more like a dragon to me. Now there will be a lot of items right here. Full restores being one of them, and uh, well, I'm trying to get this item right here. And here we have a Carbos. Now, we're going to be speeding it up right here because, well, shoot. Destiny awaits. And, well, look at this. we got two items right here. Holy buckets. Look at that. Okay, so that is awesome. And let's grab this one right here. And we got ourselves a full restore. Each one of these items is just a precursor of what's about to happen. You're going to need everything, guys. You're going to be needing every single molecule, every single, uh, you know, saving grace in order to get you around here now let's see I think there is another rare item right here make sure to bring a lot of max repels too because yes there will be some pesky Pokemon in here and well we're gonna speeding it up and let's see what we got here we found ourselves a nugget which you know you could sell for a good 5,000 and uh, well let's see this will lead us to nowhere well actually I'll lead us there so let's go right ahead and speed this through right here and again, I'm using another controller, so it's just uh, it's just the way that things go. And we're going to be going up here. This will get us an Ultra Ball. And, well, let's see. 
Yeah, we have to go right here. And where will this lead us? Okay, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna get a lay of the land right here because, well, shoot, I don't want to mess everything up. And look at this. We found ourselves a super repel, which, you know, that's that's definitely another place that you can, uh, or that definitely something that you, you'll you definitely need if you guys didn't stock up. Remember the times as a kid that, you know, repels weren't really, yeah, repels weren't really my thing, but now they've become useful. And, well, let's see. Hmm. Kind of feel like we've already been here, so let's go down here. Many of you guys are probably saying, wow, you just messed up. I don't know. Let's see. Oh, look at this. We found ourselves an escape rope, which can be useful. And, yep. Okay, so we are in the proper area. Because, yeah, there, there's a strength rock right there. So we got to go up here. And it looks like to me... It looks like to me we ended up in another in another uh, island. So here we go. Found ourselves another Ultra Ball. And, well, let's see. Let's go down here. And this will be the other location. The separate area. And it looks like to me we're just going to be grabbing some items. I know that there's some hidden items around here. But let's go right ahead and see what we can actually find. So let's go with the Max Repel. And grab this little sucker. And that is a Calcium. Definitely something that, you know, you can use for, you know, getting your Pokemon's, uh, what was it? IVs, EVs, and all that stuff. And it looks like to me... Yeah, it looks like to me that we, uh, we made our way through another island. So, I'll be right back with you guys. I'm gonna go to the proper island and all that. Okay, so it looks like to me we are in the right place. I may have made a few mistakes here and there, but... It looks like we are here in uh, where we were supposed to go. It took me quite a while. Now, I got a quick question for many of you guys. How many of you have gone through this place without Flash? I need somebody to tell me the truth. Comment down below. And it looks like to me, we... Oh, wow, we found ourselves another Max Repel, which is pretty good right here. Because, uh, yeah, I could never do this, uh... I could never do this, uh, you know, without anything now here is the individual that's gonna be blocking the way to ho or to Lugia talk to him he's gonna lead he's gonna be like that thing you have yeah the silver wing that's right we got it you have found it please go ahead okay alrighty so we're feeling pretty special now first we're gonna go right here and as you guys can see god dang that is a view that is a fantastic view and right here, you'll be finding yourself another rare candy. And, well, now all we need to do is, well, we gotta get another repel, because we we basically wasted all these repels right here, so. Uh, let's see, let's go, there's a super repel, I could use that, but I would like the max repel, because not a lot of people attack me and all that crud. So, let's go right ahead and uh, continue our adventure right here. This is a big old cave right here, and... Holy buckets. Look at that. Okay, so... It is time. So, as you guys can see, this is the location where the Lugia ritual will be done. As you guys can probably tell. There it is. I got myself a... Uh, I got myself a... Well, a, a, a recording of how the ritual will go. So... What needs to happen next is you actually have to go right here. You'll see the bells. And like I said before, this is the place where the Lugia root ritual will be done if you're playing Pokemon Soul Silver. So, I'm going to show you guys what the ritual is all about. And uh, from there, I'm just going to, you know, bring it right here. So, I'll be right back with you guys.
Okay, so as you guys can see, that was a pretty epic entrance by Lugia. I wish they would have done it right here, but no, in Pokemon Heart Gold, it will be waiting for us. So, it is time. Ah, oh, crap, we're gonna get our butts kicked, and I already know this. Okay, bring it on. Maximum effort. Here it is, Lugia is going gayas. Oh my god. Here we go. Lugia, how's it going? We got ourselves a level 70 Lugia. This Pokemon is a messed up, just a, a messed up situation right now. And as you guys can see, it will be using, it will be using a safeguard. So we're gonna try and lower its HP and then make sure that that safeguard doesn't really work. And there's its signature move, which is arrow, uh, what was it called? Uh, yeah, arrow blast. And well, as you guys can see, we're kicking its butt. And yeah, we basically wasted our body slam, mainly because, yeah, it has pressure. And, oh, there we go. Okay, so here comes its ancient power attack. And, oh my god, okay, so Lugia is literally kicking our butts. Okay, so let's see. I, I want to hit it a little bit more. Let's see. What kind of a Pokemon will it try? You know what? Let's go with Fluffolt right here. Okay. Let's see. Actually, I, I kind of feel like I messed up with Fluffolt because Lugia is a flying type Pokemon. So let's go with... Let's go with Hercules right here. And here's its safeguard. It is a complete waste. Let's go ahead and hit it with an Aerial Ace attack. And oh my god, it nearly beat it. Okay, so it is at 1 HP. We're gonna try and attack it, or we're gonna try and just like, you know, uh, we're gonna try and <laughs> capture this Pokemon and wow. Arrow Blast for the win. This god dang Lugia is just, uh, oh my god, oh god. Okay, so let's go right ahead and use... Yeah, I'm not gonna use Rainbow Chicken. Let's go with Tank right here, and it's going to... It is going to have to put up with this thing right here. Okay, so... Alright, maximum effort. Let's go ahead and throw some Pokeballs. As many of you guys already know, I bought uh, quite a few. So since we're in the... In the cave, let's go right ahead and use a Dust Ball right here. Here we go, speed it up, and... Are you serious? Are you freaking serious? No fucking way. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, so here I am bitching and complaining about how Lugia was going to be a hard Pokemon to capture and just like that. I hate this game. It just toys with my emotions. This is why I have trust issues, guys. Anywho, here is Lugia, the diving Pokemon. It is both psychic and flying. 17 feet. 476 pounds of pure rage. It is said that it quietly spends its time deep in the bottom of the sea because its powers are too strong. I hate you, Lugia. I really do. Anywho. Since we named OO Rainbow Chicken, let's go right ahead and name this Pokemon something pretty cool. Um, let's see. Hmm. Let's see. What's a good name for this Pokemon? Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Since it's at the bottom of the ocean and all that stuff, uh do, 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 do. kinda I kinda wanna okay, you know what? Let's go right ahead and go with uh Let's see, let's see. What's a good name for this Pokemon? I really want okay, so we got Rainbow Chicken. Well, this guy could be like what? Monsoon chicken or something or what? I don't even know. Rain chicken? I don't know. Tidal wave? I don't really know. Holy crud. You know what? Let's just leave it at Lugia. I mean, rainbow chicken was the first thing on my mind. This Pokemon can be a chicken and well, there it is guys. We, 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 we caught Lugia. Just like that. Man, I really wish I could go up here, but yeah, we, we, we caught that Pokemon. Uh, yeah. Okay, so let's go ahead and use that escape rope. Let's get out of here, guys. That right... <laughs> oh my god, I cannot believe that happened. Oh my god. Alright, luckily, uh, luckily for us, we got an escape rope, and we can get the heck out of here. Wow. I seriously thought it was going to be like a battle. It was going to be... Wow. 
I guess Arceus must love us right now. Anywho, let's get the heck out of here. Let's, uh, let's fly away. Let's go, Rainbow Chicken. Let's go see your best friend. The Rain Chicken or something. I don't even know what it's called. But let's go ahead and see your friend. Yeah. Oh my god. Are you serious? Wow. I am in, I am still in disbelief, guys. I really am. I am still in disbelief, and Doug is calling us. I don't know who that is. So, let's go right ahead and take a look at our newest Pokemon. Lugia. Rain Chicken. Chicken. You can just name it Chicken or something. All right. So, here it is, guys. Lugia. It has a serious nature. Ability is pressure, which is basically the reason to why we ran out of uh, body slams and all that stuff. And, no, we kind of need to check its summary right here. So, there it is. Look at that. Mm-hmm. Serious nature. A little quick-tempered and all that stuff. Very powerful. It has instantaneously become our most powerful Pokemon. And, as you guys can see, it is a very special defensive Pokemon. Yes. It's a very defensive Pokemon. It's moveset. Aeroblast. Punishment. Ancient Power, and Safeguard. Now, let's go right ahead and take a look at this. Like, Aeroblast back in the old days was like the move that I really loved for a Pokemon. I just didn't realize that, you know, Aeroblast was a signature move for this guy. And look at this, a Vortex of Air is shot at the foe to inflict damage. It has a it has a high uh, critical hit ratio. Punishment, never knew what it was. So the, this attack power increases the more the foe is has powered up uh, its stat changes, which, uh, well, I guess it should be an invincible move, an ancient power, you guys already know what it is. So, yeah, we, wow, wow, I, I cannot believe this, I cannot believe we captured Lugia just like that, wow. Spent all that money for, for nothing, okay, well. Anywho, this has been the, uh, the final episode for this week, guys. Next week, we will be capturing some more legendary Pokemon and progressing towards the very end of this uh, this walkthrough. We are very, very close, guys. Um, not only that, but I hope you guys enjoy the conclusion of our Pokemon Emerald walkthrough. As you guys already know, I did clap the crap out of, uh, of Steve, Steven Stone, so yes, thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, let's see. Yeah. Stay tuned, guys. Next week is going to be a little interesting. You guys are going to love what you're going to be seeing. So thank you guys again for watching. Thank you guys again for being supportive. As always, patient. I do have uh, a nice, uh, you know, a nice, uh, what was it called, uh, merch store. So if you guys want to support the channel, get some official GLD stuff, then, yeah, it's right down there below. Thank you guys again for watching. I'll see you guys next time.